So um, the senior exemption, uh, you get it whatever year you turn 65. So um, he turned 65 in March of 18. And um, there's two senior exemptions, one just for being 65. Now, this is a little trick up the county sleeve. This is actually the form. And you'll notice that it unfolds this way. And this is the senior exemption form. And then there's this bold line that says, if you make more than 65000 you do not qualify. And most people see that and make more and toss it in the garbage can. What they don't know is if they turn it over, on this side is the, the standard senior exemption just for being 65. All seniors get it as long as they live in the house. Now, um, Mr. Iqbal said, you know, hey, should I freeze? I said, well, technically you qualify for it because if you're under 65000 you do. Um, but always let us check your taxes first. Why? If your home is paying $3,000 more than neighbors, you want to beat it down this cycle. Don't just freeze it and, and stick yourself with taxes that are, you know, fro freeze taxes that are $3,000 high. Um, let us beat it down for two and a half years, three years, and you get it on right before the next reassessment. That's when the freeze is most beneficial. So when we checked your taxes, right, um, you were at, you, he brought the form in. He said, hey, should I do this? And I said, oh, you know what? No, because you still got $1,200 out there over the neighbors. When you first apply for the freeze, it's not a whole lot of money. It could be a 150 bucks in some cases off the tax bill. Um, right now, even after his win, there's still another $1,200 out there for him. So I told him, hey, beat it down the next couple of years and, and get it super low, then freeze it. And then you are protected from the crazy increases every three years that all the other neighbors are going to get. They're going to skyrocket. And the longer you live, the, the more you save, knock on wood. Yeah. And so um, uh, Iqbal is also a great ambassador of goodwill. Uh, how many friends do you think you brought in here to sign up? I would say uh, I, I say fifteen. Uh, yeah, I, I think about that. So twelve, twelve. He had uh, earlier in the summer. He had he, earlier in the summer. He he had this whole office full, and he had friends sitting on the steps waiting to uh, yeah. to be next. So um, all my families and all my friends and all all together, twelve to fifteen customer I bring to over here because he's. Uh, I am very much satisfied with this Angelo. He's Thank you. Very much uh, guiding. He's I'm not paying him to say it. <laughs> He's a, he's a nice guy. He to be guide to property tax. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. So, um, if you're in a senior, don't you know? In, in your like, here's the number one tip. So, on this map, every year one third of these go up. The county's cut into three chunks: north of Chicago, city of Chicago, and south. So, if you just turned 65 and 18 and thinking, "Hey, I qualify for the freeze," and I live in Chicago, whoa, hit the brakes. Most Chicago homes went up 30, 40 percent. They don't know it yet because that bill comes out this July. You should hop on Cook County Assessor, look for your house, and look at the 17 value and the much higher 18 value, and that value is hitting this July. You don't want to really freeze. You probably don't want to freeze. You should let us look at it first. Um, some some cases we might say, yes, freeze, but you should let a professional look at it. And if you just got hit with 40%, you're freezing a 40%, you know, a value that's going to be 40% higher than last year. And um, so let us check it. And, and like I said, it, it might be better off to fight it down two and a half years and get on it right before the next increase. And that prevents it from happening. And like I said, the longer you live, the more you'll, you'll keep saving. So uh, peel unfairpropertytax.com. There's a free evaluation. Um, so, uh, and if you have neighbors around you, get them fighting them like he did. Um, the more people fighting in a neighborhood proves that those values are just not what the assessor's trying to get away with. Illinois used to be the number one state people are leaving. Uh, it just recently made the news a week ago. Um, we're now number two. New Jersey beat us this year, this last year. So, But uh, the county's not losing all that money. That's like a, a jumbo jet of families one way out every day, all year long, including their businesses. The taxes that they used to pay, guess what? That burden is now yours. So um, the money our client saved, he got lowered from 331 to 320. That's just a sliver and very typical at the assessor. Um, they're going to go get it from somebody else. They're not going to lose it. So you never want to be the guy doing nothing in the number two place that people are leaving. So it's value in the service, definitely. Oh, yes. definitely. Excellent service. <laughs> I request you and I advise you. Bring and you come by yourself and Angelo will help you and you don't have to do nothing to worry. Just sleep <laughs> down and take the blanket <laughs> and sleep on him. He's going to take care of everything. Bring, bring friends like you did, yes, right? I decided. <laughs> take care. You come and bring the people and you sleep better. I appreciate it. Live, live on the Angelo. <laughs> there you go. You do nothing, you get nothing. That's the other side of that coin. So um, you always want to be on the side of the fence with people who are fighting like Iqbal. All right? Take care. Take Thank care. you. Bye.